Hi golfers and welcome to the golf hallway. Today we're going to talk about how we can fix our face. Yes, you heard me correctly. We need to fix our face. And there is one really good drill that I like to share with you guys when it comes to having an open face, which an open face can lead to many issues, primarily a slice and a right curve that is really annoying if you're struggling with that and you just seem to not be able to get rid of it. And the more left you aim, the more right it goes. We've all been there. So here's my favorite drill for you guys to do at home or also on the golf course. You can even incorporate this into your pre-shot routine, which is awesome. You can incorporate in your waggle. So let's jump into it. I want to remind you guys of the relationship of your right palm or trail palm. If you're a left, you'd be a left palm and your club face. So there is a direct relationship. Sometimes it's super helpful to imagine that that trail palm is actually a representation of your club face throughout the entire swing. So that really connects the dots for a lot of us um, because now we feel like we have a point that we can control that's much closer to us than the club face, which is obviously a lot further away from us. So. If we think about our grip in our club face, so now here, this, our right palm is basically controlling the club face and representing the club face. So when my right palm looks to the left, my club face looks to the left. If my right palm looks to the right, my club face looks to the right, and that will apply throughout the entire swing. So now all of a sudden we have a point of our body and our swing that we can control a lot easier because it's closer to us. The biggest key here is in the downswing, also in the takeaway really, but this video is about the downswing more so and the drill that happens in the downswing. And a lot of the time people go to the top and then they really kind of feel like they're, they're coming out of their spine angle. They feel like their right palm is facing forward and see how that has an open face as a result. So I'm kind of coming under, sometimes people hang back and their palm faces to the right of the target and also halfway down it starts facing forward to the wall it's almost like parallel to the wall or even a little bit behind me so that's all inside path open face right but again it's a direct representation is my palm so i'm taking my grip swinging back and now as i'm coming down i'm really feeling like that right palm is starting to turn down towards the ground a little bit more and down towards the ground, down towards the ground, and then towards the target, which will square my face. So see how that palm is now really facing flat at the target. And now we can push the ball through and we can release the club and we're going to have a much, much straighter face. Now that we know that there's a direct connection between your right palm and your club face, we can do this drill that I love and you can do this on the golf course, you can do this in the hallway, you can do this at home, you can do it in the driving range, you can even incorporate it into your actual pre-shot routine, which I love because it just reinforces the motion that you're trying to make so much better um, right before you swing. So the drill essentially is you setting up, taking it back to the top, everything stays the same, but as you're coming down, you're starting to feel like that right palm is now actually hammering flat against the ground. So it's basically up and then down. And on the range, you can hit balls with this, going back, pump, pump, through. And that's a really great pump drill. You can feel that face kind of turning down a little bit. This will fix your open face. Make sure next time you look at your golf swing and you video your golf swing, you pay attention to that right palm. Make sure you get a video from the front because that's when you can really see it well. You'll be here, you'll be turned back, and then if your right palm, your trail palm is facing forward, you don't want to see this. You want this to be facing down, halfway down your backswing, and you want to face it forward to the target at impact. So we do not want to see this. We want to see this and this. I hope you guys love this little tip. This is super simple. It's a great drill to do at home, on the range, or in your pre-shot routine. If you like this, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and leave me a comment below what you want to see next, because I cannot wait to see you next time. I'm always here to answer your golf questions.